Hello everyone, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. So today guys, we're going to be checking out two mods. Today we're going to be checking out this truck. And we're going to be checking out the trailer. The truck is the International 9300 by Overflow. It's on the Steam Workshop. Um, and the trailer I downloaded off of ModSites.com. It's the Sun Valley Car Carrier owner of car carrier where you can actually own the trailer it looks pretty good and it does have different types of cargo they they do use the same default cars in the um that you pick up but you can uh, have different options so which is pretty cool ready to rock and roll so let's get on route got 130 miles to go take this load of cars down and we'll check out the details on both of these once we get done with the run. You, you know the way I do it. We we'll have to leave the map up for this truck because it does not come with a GPS option. Turn right. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope you're enjoying the content. I was going to get into a video of this truck earlier, and uh. I can tell you right now, the only thing that I'm not really liking about this uh, truck is it needs more engine sounds. It needs better engine support than what it had. The engine support is not good. Matter of fact, let me turn the engine down just a little bit. It's a little loud. Go down a little bit, about halfway. Yeah, I think it's gonna be better. Go straight on. That's right. We'll get a thumbnail. doing well. Hope everybody's enjoying the channel. Been trying to get ahead and do some different types of content, not just ATS and LS50FR, which is my two main uh, games on this channel. But, you know, we always want to uh, extend it out, you know, play different types of games, uh, broaden the arrives in a, uh, what we play, you know. Well, get ready to turn left. The day the truck is running a uh, Cummins I-6 600 and uh, 18 speed uh, Eaton Fuller. We're also using the police um, the sound mod where it actually gives you the you have to have the default police cars. It does not work on the Metropolitan Police Pack, uh, but you have to have the default police cars, and they will. Um, they will, uh, you'll see them with the lights on, sirens uh, going down the road. Sometimes they'll be going down the road without the siren. But just remember, it does not work with the Metropolitan Police Bank. It only works on the on the default vehicles. Go ahead and get a thumbnail. And like I said, guys, we got more coming. You know, so don't worry. I've got more modded trucks I'm going to be doing, more modded trailers, or uh, regular runs over here, ETS2. Uh, I've got more content with other games that we're going to be doing. Uh, live streams, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be coming. I'm going to be uh, doing live streams. There. It's going to be starting. To, I'm going to do them on Twitch on Thursday nights. Friday and Saturday night will be done on YouTube. I've got to get a day in there where I can start doing some on Twitch. So I'm going to have to do it. But it will start earlier on Thursday night than it does on Friday night.
I will put I'm gonna post all that on my website I gotta update it I'm gonna try to update it as soon as possible Speed limit, but that's okay. Kind of being quiet, checking out the truck. And the trailer. Kind of doing a double review today. Above these. I was hoping this truck would get a little bit more updates, so uh, maybe get an engine update. This truck would be really good with the Creech Bomb engine sounds. Um, but I can say the same thing, the, the International 9900 has got a little bit of updates for the SCS version, but it hasn't got what I thought it was going to get. Keep right. Um, hopefully and it, it'll get more. Right. Exit right. Turn right. Gonna be kind of a short video, I think, today, too. But that's okay. Also, guys, don't forget we will be streaming tonight on YouTube and Mac Truck Simulator. We'll be streaming tonight. I've got a truck picked out we're going to use for the stream. We'll be a modded truck. I think we're going to use a modded truck tonight. I've already picked one out I think we're going to use. So, yeah, we're going to uh, everybody come out and join. We're going to be uh, starting around 8 o'clock on a YouTube channel.
makes it right. Exit right. Well, get ready to turn left. So I mean you guys have played the Alaskan truck similar demo. I played it and I can say that there's a lot of stuff and then that turn left. This isn't a game I wish was in this game. Um Turn left. I think eventually we'll get it. What are we going this way for? Oh, okay. I know what they're doing. Turn right. I think there's a lot in the game that I, that we, I wish we had in this game, but I hope eventually we'll, we'll get there. Get right, and then exit right. Exit right. Turn right. I don't know why we're taking these SUVs to Napa, but okay. Keep right, and then turn right. I don't ask questions. I'm just the driver. I'm just taking it where they say take it. So that's all we're gonna do. Outside view of the truck pulling in here. Well, that's probably back up. I'm pretty sure they're going to want us to go around the back of the building with it. Alright, well they want it. Yep, they want it. Um... I believe they weren't on that side right there. If I'm not mistaken. Not sure. We're gonna see. I think they want it over here. Mm, 
Nope. And not over here. So it's gotta be around by. Okay. They pulled a fast was on us there. Right there is where they want it. Ugh. Well, if I didn't know that, I'd have backed around the building. I just don't think we're going to get turned around back here, even with this. We made me get turned around. to get turned around. Don't want to hit that trailer. There we go. One thing good about having a little day cab. Get that little bit of extra ring. That's it. Unload. So we drove extra. We drove 131 miles. Took us six hours, six minutes to get here. We assume 18 gallons of fuel. So we're gonna go ahead and do this right here. Hit continue. So we're gonna go over into. I'm gonna show you the options for both of these: the truck and the trailer. All right. So go to go to mine. Alright, so here's the International 9300i, the day cab. You have two configurations. You have a 72-inch sleeper, a day cab, right here. You have two chassis, a, si a short 6x4 and a short 6x4. Pretty much, it just changes the um, gas tank in a step, what it does. Yeah, okay. Engine options is here's something that I think is lacking in. It does have all the cash options for his excuse me for his engines. It would really need it needs some more support for engines. It really does. Excuse me, you have a ten speed, even full of transmission. All the way up to 18 speed eating full with a retarder for the truck. Uh, you have two interiors, a uh, dark wood, and a light wood. 
paint schemes you have blue red white black dark blue gray green sun yellow silver your um custom colors you can actually have two of the stripes here metallic blue metallic red custom shader here okay your options you have um overload sign you have one two you have uh, four bumpers um nothing here but standard for the grill standard for the hood you do have a reflector if you wanted one you have hood mirrors flags uh chrome and painted a uh, sun visor your lights horns that's your for your strobes your mirrors you have two chrome versions of mirrors with lights there you can choose your lights which is pretty neat that they do that they give you that you change this to chrome change this to chrome change your uh smoke your uh, exhaust pipes to uh, double single uh, uh single with a shield or just single exhaust a rear exhaust yeah re rear with a shield i'm sorry i can't talk today for some reason rear with a shield or a double uh, three different types of mud flaps uh, i i do have some mods in here for wheels smarties icoa pack vipers uh I call a, I call a pack. So your may not yours may not look like mine. So So here's the inside of the truck. You have two different steering wheels. That's just a mirror you can actually add a like a bottle of water or something here just one option for that you put a winter present you put a mirror there that's pretty much it for all your customization for the truck okay so we're gonna go to the customization for the trailer all right here it is the sun valley car care oh, this is the owner trailer it does it starts off it comes in red so you have just one option the single now you have different colors you can paint it white body red body painted body or black body that's what you can paint you have a black two axle painted two axle red two axle or white two axle and this painted and here is your options for the there's uh this is for lights you have black logo painted logo white logo that gives you the Sun Valley trailer and it puts the lights on there all right so we'll move on to as you will as you know you can you can do any any kind of tie you want uh, it has pretty much all the options here uh, default tire uh, trailers have I want to say default tires what am I talking about um, yeah I, like I said I do have uh, Vipers Akoa pack installed and Smarties pack so it, it, yours will be a little bit different but yeah that, that's all your options but it's, it is a good looking trailer I, I do like the trailer it, it looks good
Alright guys, that's where we're going to wrap up today's video. Just want to get ahead and do a little short mod review on two mods. Don't want to get ahead and do one on this truck. I just have not had a chance to get one in for this truck. So we finally got a decal version. Now we will, I will go back and do another video of it. Uh, do it a sleeper version if you want to see it. Just let me know. I, I, I can do that. I had no problem doing that. Uh, and I want to get in and do one of this trailer. So we did a, a double mod review today. So uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And have a good day.